Oh god, that's Katy Perry. Welcome back to another daily video of singing geniuses. It's me, another fellow singing genius. And today we're gonna be looking at famous singers before they were famous versus now. Did they get better? Did they get worse? Probably better, but who knows? <laughs> so this all started when I came across this video. Me singing Skyscraper by Demi Lovato and it is by Camila Cabello. And I thought it was interesting. Funny thing is that since Camila Cabello is such a like new artist, this is not actually that long ago. This was uploaded in 2011. And this is her old channel, Carla Cabello. Hello. Hi guys, this song makes me cry every time I hear it. It's amazing and Demi Lovato's voice, she's incredible. Let's listen to her sing and then compare it to her singing something today. No. Already a vocal run, two seconds in. You can take everything I have. You can break everything I am. Like I'm made of <laughs> Vocal run on every phrase. That's funny. Like, that's so just over the top. Just vocal runs all the time. It was good. It was pretty good. I know that she's a lot better nowadays, though, so let's compare it. It took me back to these Atlanta, na na na, babe. Oh, but my heart is in Havana. There's something about his manners. Yeah. Nice. Didn't me feeling like, That's so dope. Oh god, okay, I love that. She's amazing now, like so confident. It's a joy to see, really. Great job! Camila Cabello got better between 2011 and 2017. Six years, and you improve. You get a thumbs up from me. By the way, please like this video if you haven't already. Next! Okay, so this is Adele in 2007, playing live in Lancaster Library. Adele. That's insane. It shouldn't be a weird thing that a famous artist at one point played in a library. But for some reason in my brain, it's like, whoa, she played in a library? That's crazy. <laughs> I'm stupid, okay? Who adds some spines to the rhythm of life? Ooh, welcome sunrise with a morning glory. She sounds very much the same. I've changed my mind. There is no simple life for me. So good. I wanna feel my heartbeat. Nice. Okay, so it might have been the bad audio quality a little bit, but I did feel like she's a little bit jazzier here. Like it sounds a little bit more like a jazz singer and a little bit less like the kind of like more solely singer that I felt like she's been during her pop years. Even though a lot of the qualities that she has as a pop singer obviously just shine through here. Like the pronunciation is very similar. The big vowels sound very similar when she really belts. But yeah, man, this library thing is killing me. This is really funny. Fun. Next, here's a little compilation called Famous Singers Singing as Child Slash Teenager years. Let's have a look. Wait, what? Is that Fergie? No. She looks so different. That's crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know why I think that's so funny and then like it becomes this weird music later. How come every time I come around my London, London break when a good Honestly, she's not bad. Now that I look at it, it's like, yeah, she, she's fine. She's pretty good. She was good as a kid too, though. I can't choose my favorite between Tiny Fergie and older Fergie, okay? Oh, Shakira. God, she looks different. Yeah, you can hear the Shakira in there. Let's be real though, I, Shakira was never known for her amazing singing voice. She's like a great stage personality and whatever. I watched the Super Bowl performance and you know, it was fine and everything. It's amazing that she can do all those dance moves when she's old. <laughs> 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 but however, 
she still lip synced the whole thing. No question about it. It was full on lip sync throughout. Hey, if you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe and turn on notifications. Okay, next. Wait, did she sing Donald Duck in the very end? Oh god, Kesha. She looks totally different too. What what's happening? The band's amazing too. They're just sitting there like so stiff. Like <laughs> You can kind of hear the starts of like the Kesha type twangy singing there. That's pretty cool. And you know, Kesha's amazing now. We looked at that the other video. She did some high whistle notes. <laughs> Okay, I mean, I can't do it. Anyway, she's good. Let's continue. Oh God, that's Katy Perry. She looks so much like Draco Malfoy from Harry Potter. Oh my God, Katy Perry without makeup is Draco Malfoy. That's crazy, dog. Katy Perry's old live stuff is just funny because she did like only Christian music. It's so weird that she went fully from Christian music to like stuff when she wore like no clothes and just went totally pop. It's crazy. I think Katy Perry is a competent singer. I know a lot of people give her flack, but I saw her live and I thought it was good. Especially the uh, acoustic parts she did as part of her set. Let's see. Man, again, just going like from like a small setting to a massive crowd of people. Celebrities, they're like us. It's true. was nice maybe not the best example of katie's current vocals she goes a lot more powerful and stuff too but yeah it was good oh god taylor swift singing star spangled banner as a kid that's crazy It's fascinating how kids just look like kids. Like, you can see some things that this will end up to be Taylor Swift, but it doesn't look like Taylor Swift. The lips, maybe you can see a little bit, or like the overall face structure, but it just looks like a kid. Kids don't look like people. Okay, so here's a rare, rare video that maybe isn't that rare, but I'm gonna pretend it's very rare. It's Billie Eilish singing with Phineas, her brother, before their fame, and Phineas has very long hair here, very different from now. Let's have a listen. This can't be that long ago. Think so far. It's beautiful. So yeah, it sounds pretty similar to how Billy sings nowadays. It's very low volume, very controlled, kind of like falsetto-like tonal quality. It sounds really nice though. One of the comments said something that people think she can't sing and just whispers into the mic. She totally watch videos like this. Maybe there's some more belty stuff in here. Let's see. Okay, so here she is singing in what looks like a church. A lot of good musicians come from churches. Not calling myself an amazing musician or anything, but I did a lot of musician stuff in the church and I have a lot of friends who did too. I think growing up during the time that I did, the church was one of the best places to learn how to play music. Nowadays, it's probably the brony fandom or something. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, you don't hear her sing like that a lot anymore. So yeah, I mean, it's a little bit of a different thing. It wasn't like a big voice per se, but it was a little bit more belty than the other stuff I've heard from Billy, at least. To be fair though, I'm not the biggest Billy expert out there. Maybe some people could tell me in the comments. Just link me to the strongest, most powerful Billy vocals, and I'll check that out in some videos soon. This is Billy Eilish nowadays. Let's have a listen. Tore my shirt to stop. Quiet when I'm going home and I'm on my own. So 
super good, I think. Like, hits the notes really perfectly. Very nice, you know, vibe and little vibratos on different notes and stuff. Good feel. Some of the high notes became just whispers, but that almost just made it a little bit cooler or better, I thought. Click here for more music reaction videos and click here for Rumi's greatest hits, which also has stuff like me singing or whatever. Stupid stuff like that. And I'll see you in tomorrow's daily video. Bye.